Thank you. Court concluding for the week in the Alex Jones defamation damages trial with heartbreaking testimony from the Sandy Hook dad who is central to the case. Robbie Parker has been the focus of Jones's lie that the school shooting was staged. News 12 Connecticut's Marissa Alter reports. Robbie Parker took the stand for a second day, and like with his wife, Alyssa, it was incredibly difficult to listen to his testimony. He described the years of online abuse, death threats, and public confrontations because of years of Alex Jones's lies. I couldn't protect. I felt like I couldn't protect Emily's name or her memory anymore. Robbie Parker had to shut down the Emily Parker Memorial page on Facebook after it was inundated with hate fueled by lies from Alex Jones that Sandy Hook was a hoax. Jones had seized on an emotional news conference Parker gave the day after his daughter, 19 of her classmates, and six educators were killed. In it, Parker laughed nervously as he approached the sea of cameras. Jones would call him an actor over and over, leading to a new wave of attacks each time. Eventually, we started looking at places to move because um, I just wanted to get some anonymity. The family moved to Washington State but couldn't escape the online harassment and threatening letters. Four years after and 3,000 miles away, Parker was confronted on the street by a stranger. And he was looking at me and he said, how do you sleep at night? You and I just kind of was really taken back by that and I stared at him and he had so much venom and so much hatred for who he thought that I was. How much money did you get from the government? Parker testified he stayed silent about the abuse for fear of encouraging it. But in 2018, as families of Parkland shooting victims endured the same lies from Jones, Parker did something. He joined this lawsuit. I don't need to be quiet anymore. And I can say something and I can fight this. Testimony continues Tuesday, and we do expect both sides to conclude presenting evidence at some point next week. That does include a return to the stand for Alex Jones, who's set to testify in his defense. As we learned the last time, expect the unexpected. In Waterbury, Marissa Alter, News 12, Connecticut. All right, Marissa, thank you. It's up to a jury of six to decide how much Jones will pay these Sandy Hook families and an FBI agent as well. The judge already found Jones liable by default. Last month, a Texas jury ordered that he pay nearly $50 million to the parents of another Sandy Hook victim.